Kim Kardashian, Miley Cyrus, are they feminists? Um, yeah, I mean, if they believe in, in the social, political, economic equality between both genders, then yeah, they're feminists. It's not for, uh, it's not for someone else to say yes or not, you're a feminist. Like, I, so is, is getting your bum out to try and break the internet, is that what feminism is about? Is that girl power it's these not days? It's all that feminism is about, but it's extremely unfair to say that, that, that's, not, that that's not feminism. I mean, it's not fair to, for, for, for you to decide that she's not a feminist because she got to get her bum out. Like that's, I mean, that's basically slut shaming the thing that you were just saying, which is negative. Like there's all these negative I connotations. I didn't say it, I was just putting it out there. <laughs> no, <by> the <laughs> Sorry, yeah, that was unfair of me. <laughs> but uh, and anyone else think that Kim Kardashian or, or, or Miley Cyrus is a good or a bad role model for women today? Do you think that they may possibly be part of a problem of hypersexualization, which is a, a major problem facing young women these days? I think it's like in terms okay. of women like young women if they look at this and thinking oh this is what's sexy for men and they're thinking oh what's sexy in general and if they think that's sexy then they think oh well i must wear things like that i must follow what they do i must whatever and then that leads on and other girls start thinking this and it's kind of like this whole and then that can lead to different things like eating disorders things like that people think they have to be skinny they have to think, like work out get implants things like that so but in terms of kim kardashian and Miley cyrus a lot of people say they're not aren't feminists because that's what they're doing and they're showing their body and they're doing it for men. But a lot of time it could be that they're just doing it because they want, like they have that asset that they want to show. Mm -hmm. And sometimes it can be shown in the media wrong. So like it's, it's brought up. They seem up. like they're very in control of what they're doing now. Yeah, Fairness. like a lot of time it's the media saying, oh, like um, Kim Kardashian's ass is like, God, like basically like that everyone should have it. It's a separate thing. Yeah, yeah. so like it's not, it's nothing to do with kind of what men want, right? It's kind of like, and then a lot of men say, oh, well, I'm not really into any of that. So it's kind of, the media is pushing that, so. But, but women undressing on the internet and on uh, covers, is that part of a problem where women are being objectified? Is she contributing to that? She, in, yeah, in a sense she is because she- so how could she be a feminist then if she's contributing to an atmosphere where women are objectified? Well, there's a sense as well that like feminism, a lot of people say like, um, I think Lady Gaga and stuff, I say that, like, you should show your body. Like, it shouldn't Don't like, be ashamed Marilyn of Marilyn Monroe, it. I think, like, it shouldn't be, like, a shameful thing for you to show mm. your body, because back in 1920 or something, women had to wear, like, skirts to their knees. They couldn't show anything. In certain countries, they can't show anything. Mm. So, in a sense, it's kind of like, you have your body, show it. Yeah, but nobody but, shows their real body now. You know, this yeah. issue of body hair and women, you know, hair has been at the front line of feminism for years. I mean, Kim, that's not Kim Kardashian's real body. She was airbrushed when, within an inch of her life. I mean, in reality, mm. if she let herself go, go to seed, as it were, she wouldn't look like that. Yeah, but a lot of people, like, I know, like, if you want to shave your body, it's for, a lot of time it's just for yourself. Like, you don't, if you're, if you're into, like, being hairy, that's fine. <laughs> yeah. But if you want to be, like, it, it's, a, it's, it's about like, choice. It's about choice, saying. exactly. Okay. So more choice over than for someone else. Right? All right.